Married at First Sight Season 17, the real reason Austin and Becca haven't talked about the uh, hard stuff in their relationship Becca and Austin from Married at First Sight Season 17 have not talked about the uh, hard stuff in their relationship yet, and that could be bad. Married at First Sight Season 17 couple Becca and Austin have not talked about the uh, hard stuff in their marriage yet, which could become a problem. Becca and Austin met for the first time at the altar and were immediately smitten with each other. They felt comfortable immediately, and their humor and personalities were obviously compatible. The morning after their wedding, Becca divulged her health issues and the pain they caused her to Austin, who took the news well. However, outside of that, Becca and Austin have not discussed core and potentially controversial things that need to be discussed in a marriage. Married at first sight viewers have been watching Austin and Becca on their honeymoon, and they appear to be the most well-matched couple. They had a slight disconnect after Becca spent time with the wives on the honeymoon and gushed about her relationship with Austin. During Austin's talk with the husbands, he downplayed how well he thought his marriage was going so as not to rub his happiness in the faces of the husbands who were struggling. Becca let him know she wished he had been more open, and Austin understood her concern and apologized. They may have sorted through those two issues okay, but bigger hurdles are ahead. Becca and Austin have a lot in common Becca and Austin have showcased that they were matched together for a reason. Austin is a typical Colorado guy who holds a lot of value in marriage. Becca is a spunky wedding photographer who wants someone to love her despite her chronic health problems and doesn't see her as a burden. It seems that she's found that in Austin, whose high emotional intelligence aligns with Becca's need for affirmation. Becca and Austin are video game nerds who have also proved that they like to be social and have close inner circles. They are good supporters of the other couples and have no problem being affectionate. Becca and Austin have not talked about their differences while Becca and Austin look good on paper and have chemistry, there are potential differences that lay ahead that could put their relationship to the test. Becca and Austin have been focused on having good times together and a good setting to bring up hard topics has not arisen yet. They might be worried their dynamic could change once they point out their first differences. Whether either one is willing to compromise on sensitive things could also be a point of contention and a deterrent for talking about hard stuff. Becca and Austin have also not been intimate yet as they build their emotional connection. However, positive Becca and adventurous Austin don't seem like sex will be an issue to navigate for them. They have proved so far that they are there for each other, but topics like religion, money, and lifestyle choices could prove to crack the married at first sight season 17 couple's foundation they've built. How Becca's health issues will develop and how Austin will handle them are also tough things that could make the relationship more work. Today's next news. Married at First Sight UK Bride on Painful and Frustrating Health Battle Viewers Didn't See. Peggy Rose Lawrence has revealed she spent time in hospital during filming for Married at First Sight UK. Married at First Sight UK Bride Peggy Rose Lawrence has opened up about the a painful and frustrating health battle she endured while filming the series. The star's update comes after Peggy finally confirmed that she and groom George Berthano are still going strong months after the 2023 show ended. And during a recent question and answer session on her Instagram, Peggy was asked what the worst and best parts of filming Maths UK were. Sharing a picture of herself suffering a reaction, she explained, my most painful and frustrating part was definitely my allergy to dust and pollen, Wembley cut their grass several times a day and we were a stone's throw from the grounds. My whole face was swollen and painful to touch. I never knew I had this until I had it for four weeks during filming as soon as we moved into the new build apartments. I had several hospital trips for medications, steroids, and antibiotics, they didn't know what it was. 
she added that having to film and be her happy self was difficult, before adding, I know there are worse things in the world before anybody reminds me and my heart goes out to those suffering. This is minor just answering the question. On her favorite memories, Peggy said, my best part was obviously meeting George. There are loads of best bits. Our wedding day, final date, and vow renewal in particular. It comes after Peggy confirmed the pair were still together. Over the weekend, the star shared a series of loved-up snaps on social media and wrote, confirmed, we're still together. We held back on sharing and smothering socials to give ourselves some much-needed quality time post the show ending. Although we are in a relationship, we still have our own identity and individuality, that's what makes us so strong. As cliché as this sounds, we want to thank you all for your patience, it hasn't been easy, but sharing our journey with you means the world as your ongoing love and support are everything to us. You can read more here. For more showbiz and television stories, get our newsletter here. Today's next news. Married at first sight couple confirms they're still together despite fans convinced of split. Married at First Sight star Peggy Rose has posted a joint statement with George Berthano saying that they are still very much together despite speculation they had split Married at First Sight UK stars Peggy Rose and George Berthano have issued a joint statement on Instagram, in which they have confirmed they are still a couple despite speculation that their relationship had ended. The pair, who met on the show, have been the subject of rumors among fans of the show that they had split but the couple have shared a defiant message on social media, in the hope of putting the issue to bed, once and for all. Peggy Rose indicated that while they are together, they still have their own identities and individual projects which they share on social media, so that is why fans may not see lots of photos of them together posting a number of photos of their relationship together, including snaps from their wedding day, Peggy Rose wrote, confirmed, we're still together. Heart, champagne and celebratory emojis. We held back on sharing and smothering socials to give ourselves some much needed quality time post the show ending. Although we are in a relationship, we still have our own identity and individuality, that's what makes us so strong. Peggy Rose continued on the post, as cliché as this sounds, we want to thank you all for your patience, it hasn't been easy, but sharing our journey with you means the world as your ongoing love and support are everything to us. Plus, we have more exciting news, we've created joint accounts to share our life post MAFS. Follow along for more updates. Here's to the next chapter. Fans will now get their fill of the MAFS star's lives with the new joint page on Instagram and they hope that will put paid to speculation about their relationship, with more access to what they are doing together. Peggy Rose, who entered the show due to her intense job as a technology risk partner hindering her love life, has credited MAFS for enabling to pursue a career she loves after her previous role began causing her Heath issues. Speaking to OK, she revealed, my old job was making me ill. I hadn't had a period in four years because of stress with my job. She has now started her own fashion business and told OK, I'm a reseller of unique clothes. It's called off the peg boutique because when I was bridal dress shopping, I'm tall and the only dresses I could find were off the peg. It's married at first sight that actually enabled me to do something I'm happy with because I absolutely loved the process. I loved the experience and I thought I haven't been this happy since probably moving school. Thanks for watching this videos, please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.